Hey guys, welcome back. This is PC Smith Knight, and today I will be sh showing you some cool new things that I've added to the chassis and going to be adding in the future. Uh, I have touched on these in the last video, and some new ones I will be showing you. So, without further ado, to do, I'll show you right now. Right, um, I'm just setting up all the GYs now with the buttons that actually uh, work. Not not labels, but they're actual buttons now, so that's good. Um, yeah, so one moment. Right, so as you see, we've got the fuel system. Uh, they are, it's just a block at the moment. That will be used for uh, receiving and giving the engine fuel. Right, if I move, oh, if I change that to one and move it. Bro, that close that. Right, if I open this up. Right, as you see by that, I'm using some uh, little template but there, that's off of uh, another game. But we will be making our own materials and stuff, like different models and all. So, um, yeah. Right, let me see. So all I want is to change that. There you go. So as you see, there's a gas tank there. Or a jerry can, as you uh, would say. So uh, either use a pump or you can use a jerry tank. Either one, they work. They will work soon. And all you'll have to do is just simply touch it to the fuel place area. Um, which is the block um, there will be animations with it and due to Roblox not selling animations at the moment I will be giving out uh, animations with the car so you will have animations not any crap or anything like that so animations would be kind of like tipping the jerry can into the fuel gas tank uh, so basically like this, let me see, so it go like that, and it go like that once it's done, um, and it'll have sound effects with it, like a emptying or filling up. Uh, you may have noticed these, if you have not, I don't know why, but um, if you have guessed, these are actually spillage. These can be used as spilling the gas or a gas, uh, the fuel leak. So spilling the fuel or either the uh, gas tank is leaked. As you notice, there's another one and this is for oil. And this will be for the engine when it gets um, well, when it gets damaged to a certain point, so, yeah, so I've labelled these, and these are mesh, which I've created out of a block, so there's, um, glass as the top layer, and then inside the glass there's another layer which is neon, and that gives it the effect with the glass that it's a 3D effect. So it gives you that more realistic effect of, um, of substances. Um, and it gives you a nice look to it as well and it kind of looks like um, actual fuel. 
Um, on top of that, um, on top of that, I will be. Yeah, I will be um, connecting up the GUI to the vehicle seat so these gauges work. Um, but at the minute, that will be held because one of my uh, one of the persons that I'm asking to do it is busy. So yeah. Um, but the chassis is coming along really well, surprisingly uh, really fast since my scripter is busy and it's just been really fast uh, because I didn't think he'd be able to do it this fast but look enough we are. It's in, well it was in pre-alpha but I'm thinking now it's getting to alpha the way it's going. We will be hooking up the fuel system soon, which is a good sign. So that's coming out of alpha then, once we do that. And it'll be in uh, beta. we got to hook up the lights. Uh, at the minute, the lights aren't connected to the system, as you'll see here. I can, con uh, I can change them outside of the vehicle, so we got to fix that. So yeah. Right, and we still got that little glitch which we which we all fix. That's nothing I did. As you see animations, but we gotta fix the animation. Cause that's messed up. Thanks to Roblox. But this animation system isn't made by me, it's made by Rick12. Uh Rick12 made uh I think it was Inspire. Uh, he also, no, I'm not, no, I wasn't inspired actually, no, I'm not sure. Um, I know he made a certain vehicle, a massive vehicle, which is a SUV. But, um, yeah. And he made motorbikes, yeah. Uh, with Inspire, so yeah. Uh, but apart from that, this animation is just garbage, thanks to Roblox. It still works, thank god. It's just the head, it looks messed up. As you'll see, sometimes there will be two faces and you can see slight deeper there. But yeah, that's because of Roblox basically. Um, as you'll notice, you can still click this, but when when it's fixed, you every time you click it, I'm clicking it right now. Every time you click it, it doesn't do anything, so it'll only affect it once it's broken down. Um, so, for example. If I can trigger this to break down one sec, let me see if I can trigger it. Let me see if my script has added that in to trigger it. There you go. There's one, there's two, there's three, four, and five. And I fixed it. So, uh, yeah, the script is very simple. Um, it will be refined a bit, the system, before it's released. That way, then, we have guarantees that it won't affect anything. Um, this system isn't as good as ATS, but in the future it will be. Um, I'm planning on asking someone else who makes really, really good cars, I mean phenomenal cars, to actually assist me, because he's quite a nice scripter as well. And I might be collaborating with him and 
working with him on his car uh, to help him with his cars as well so this will benefit for him if he's open about it and if he chooses to he's welcome not to is is his choice basically I'm not going to force it on him or anything because it's not fair um, plus you shouldn't really force anything on anyone um, right but yeah the suspension is coming along really nice uh, I've refined it and the suspension is golden it's there it's literally done all the suspension the system it just needs help with deceleration uh, picking up the pace when it's driving and it needs sound effects which we've got here so deceleration script which I need to redo this is often another car but this is for reference which we will be using uh, we might not use this we might make our own script we might not I think my script is going to use his own script but we can look at that for reference and then we're going to use this so yeah um, this will help us with the engine side of it but we're going to make a nicer engine script for it um, one sec so yeah Right, do I have been seen now? Where am I? Don't think I need that there. I don't know, do I? What's calling the... No, I don't think I need that. If I remove that, let's see what happens. Um, yeah, it is actually being called. 924. What's I using that? I don't think it's affecting. Hang on, let me test. Test. Because I think that line is basically nothing. Let me just say it all. Yeah, it's nothing. I don't need that. Right. Well, so uh, we will be sorting out all of the car's systems before it's released. Um, yeah, so basically that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. And this is BC Smith Knight, and I'll catch you guys next time.